Mr. Shoffley is with us at the 106 PGA Championship. We're going to jump right into questions, starting on seven. How do you, how do you uh, holistically, how do you process these first three days? You, you go super low uh, on Thursday and then a, a bit of a grind the last two days. I mean, that's pretty, you summed it up for me. Yeah, it was uh, easy, easy going there the first round. Uh, everything felt super easy. Felt like I had, I've had to work for a lot of my birdies uh, the last two days. Just haven't been able to make many putts. I feel like I'm still hitting the ball. I got to look at the stats, but I feel like I'm still hitting the ball pretty nice. So if I can just get the putter going a little bit, uh, it should free me up. Like 13. How do you approach tomorrow? Just like any other tournament for the most part. Uh, it's, uh, it's another Sunday. Uh, I typically love Sundays. So I think I need to really just stay in my lane and do a lot of what I've been doing and uh, just worry about myself. Is there any difference uh, based on the circumstance that you share the lead and that there's a, a bunch of guys right behind you? Uh, I mean, I said it yesterday. It's funny. Uh, I said there's blood in the water. Everyone kind of laughed. And then, you know, Shane Lowry almost shot 61 today. So, um, yeah, I imagine someone in that threshold now that, you know, it's been done twice is going to shoot something low and post a number early. I, I imagine that's going to happen. So. Like I said, you know, uh, just staying, staying in my lane is, is what's going to make me play well. Mike, 12? Uh, I was sort of going to ask the same question. There, it's such a bunch leaderboard right now. Does it make it somewhat, I know you guys always want to have the lead, but like, does it make it somewhat better or, or is there a silver lining in that you know you have to go out and earn it and there's nothing to protect? No, you want the lead. Yeah. <laughs> Against these guys, you want any, as many shots as you can possibly take, and, uh, no matter how nerve-wracking it can be. Mike, five, then one. Hi, Xander. Uh, winning Olympic gold, of course, is very special, very prestigious. But I'm wondering, what would a first major title mean to you, your friends, your family? Yeah, it would mean a lot. Uh, it, at the end of the day, I mean, it's just a result. Winning, it, winning a tournament is just a result. So all I can focus on are, are good golf shots and, and striking good putts. And so uh, at the end of the day, you know, wherever the cards fall, they fall. But uh, yeah. It, it would mean a lot, obviously. It's more than just a result, though, surely. Come on. I mean, it really <laughs> is just a result, you know. Um, but, yeah, like I said, it, it would mean a ton. We wish you well. Thank you. Mike, one. Xander, do you mind walking us through your second, third, and fourth shots on, on 15? Second shot, 162 yards. Uh, the wind was sort of swirling. The, it was, you know, into the wind. Uh, the flags were kind of showing down. Um, I tried to hit, like, a kind of a – Soft, sort of low draw, nine iron. Uh, got a little bit on top of it. Didn't feel like I, I was trying to hit it hard. I have no idea how it went that far, to be completely honest. I thought it would have been sort of where my chip ended up. Um, the next shot out of the fescue was brutal. Uh, if there wasn't a hazard over the green, I probably would have swung a lot harder. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I knew it was going to come out dead. I just couldn't get myself to swing at it. Um, if I could go back, I, I would have hit it harder, obviously. but. Uh, and then didn't hit a hit a good lie actually on my, on my fourth shot, didn't really hit a great chip, um, and uh, yeah, lift out another nine or ten footer uh, like most of the day today. Got time for one more up at Mike 14. You talked about your putter being hot the first day. Lowry today, his putter was hot. Does it just feel like tomorrow it'll come down to kind of who has a hot putter in some ways? I mean, it's going to come down to a lot more than that, but it, it kind of feels that way with the greens being receptive and the fairways being receptive um, and, you know, hopefully it being a little bit e even drier, the ball might roll a little bit more. So, yeah, it, it might it might come down to something like that. Thanks for your time, Xander. Thank you.